All right, so um, this is about uh, combining the networking TS with algorithms. I was in Michael's workshop on Tuesday, and uh, I've been long interested in ASIO, um, but I've never actually tried to use it before. So during the end of that uh, second session, I started working on integrating an algorithm library I've been working on with ASIO, well, as the networking TS. So I built um, three operators, connect, send, and read, on top of around um, async, read, async, send, etc., async, connect, and then uh, I could use them with all of the algorithms that are available in the library. So, uh, for instance, just is taking the string and making a, uh, an observable out of it that will then produce that string into the send, which is an operator that will then call async send. And once it's finished sending, that will complete. And since I'm using concat, only after that will rx read be called. It will produce a new observable of the received bytes or strings. And then I share these chunks because I want to break out both the headers and count the number of bytes read. And so I built another operator called split that uses uh, regex tokenizer to split the lines out. And I take all of the lines until there's an empty line, which is the end of the headers <coughs> in a simplistic slide level code segment. And then I can also scan, which is just like accumulate or reduce, only it, re it produces as output every intermediate calculated value. And so I can then take those things and combine them. This third stream response updates I take all of the chunks that are coming in as I read them, and I replace the string of the actual data with the string response so that I don't overflow my console in a minute. And so now I can take the headers, and after the headers finishes, I can produce end headers, and after that finishes, I can produce the response updates. And I can then from that stream, every time something is emitted by that stream, I can take the most recent size calculation starting with zero. And then I just subscribe to it. Nothing happened up to this point. This is the only time when things start happening. So I subscribe to it. Uh, I have a little helper that produces a function object so that I don't have to see the tuple that was produced by with latest from. And that's what comes out. Little bonus. Uh, I'd actually had this on my slide before uh, David Senkel's talk earlier. Um, but using the same three operators, connect, read, and send, this produces a client, not a server echo. So every read just gets emitted from send. And if you want to see more of these algorithms, I'll be uh, having a talk tomorrow at 2.30. Thank you.